stars of Grace and Frankie, Jane Fonda and Lily Tomlin, season four. <laughs> Behind the bar, they are the uh, all stars from RuPaul's Drag Race. Milk, Morgan McCullough, Shangela, Kennedy Davenport, Thorgy Thor, and Chi Chi Devane. Thank you so much. We love it when you guys are here. We really appreciate it. Uh, let's go back to the phones. Caller, what's your name, and from where are you calling? Hi, Andy. It's Betsy from Phoenix. Hey, Betsy, what's your question? Uh, my question's for Lily. I just wanted to know, what was your relationship like with Goldie Hawn on Laugh In? And did you ever expect her to become such a superstar? Expect her? Yeah. Uh, well, she pretty much was on her way when she, I was, I worked one day with Goldie at that time because she left the next day to go do Cactus Flower. Oh, you're kidding. Yeah, which was, uh, the movie that she crossed over with, mm -hmm. and uh, and she just had a string of hits after that. Yeah, and she was and I was friendly with her. I mean, we didn't really spend a lot of time, but I would, I've been to her house a few times, and we'd go to do something. And she recently asked me to do something for her charity, which is kind of marvelous. She works with children and teaches them meditation and all kinds of things to educate them and make them cool. Uh. <laughs> By the way, did you see there was there was renewed talk of um, of the incredible shrinking woman recently when Downsizing came out? I'm wondering if you saw it, Downsizing. Oh, I did. I did see it, and uh, I uh, I didn't think it was entirely successful in terms of the concept. Mm -hmm. um, but Jane, my partner, who had written a screenplay for for a uh, shrinking woman, she kind of had that original idea to use, but. Uh, the director in the studio didn't want to do it. Yeah. And that was that the people are shrinking it to make the planet sustainable and all uh -huh. that stuff. Wow. Uh, it was an interesting concept. Both were great concepts. Yeah. Uh, back to the phones. Call her. What's your name and from where are you calling? Hi, Andy. It's Amy from Virginia. Hey, what's your question? My question is for Jane. Jane, what was your reaction when your eclipse photo went viral? Oh, your eclipse photo went viral this year. The photo. Oh, of you I all. was so happy. Yeah, <laughs> it was well, so I, great. I wish I'd seen that. I had an eclipse photo. You did. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it went anywhere. Yeah. <laughs> Wasn't the eclipse amazing? The eclipse was one of my highlights of last year. It was great. It was yeah. really super. Thanks cool. for using it at the New Year's Eve. Oh, thing. I did use oh, it on New Year's you Eve. Didn't I did. Time. I showed your photo. I did. <laughs> How'd you know that? But have you ever seen mine? I've never seen mine. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Back to the phones. Call her, what's your name and from where are you calling? Well, my name is Lisa and I'm calling from Clawson, Michigan. Hey Lisa, what's your question? Well, I had a question for Jane, please. Okay. I was going to say, Jane, you said that you hoped to get Dolly Parton on an episode of Grace and Frankie. Are you any closer to making that happening? Uh, we're still, it's a work in progress. Right. <laughs> well, I don't understand what the issue is. It seems like a simple call. I mean. <laughs> well, it's working out a schedule. She's so busy. Got it. She has some, Got yeah. It. Yeah. Families. Okay. Uh, back to the phones. Call her. What's your name? Oh, If on, this call look. isn't for me, I'm leaving. <laughs> speaking, <laughs> speaking of Dolly. Speaking of Dolly, have you met Carl Dean? Yes. 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 Many times. Oh, God, I, I adore him. him. Have you not met him? No. For real? Weren't you on the set when he came on the set? Oh, maybe. Oh. <laughs> I'd forgotten that. He looked kind of like my dad. He looks kind of like my dad. And he's, oh, I could tell stories about him. Really? Well, I'm trying to do it real, can I? Yes, yeah. yes. Okay, so I spent the night with him in Nashville, you know. Okay. Uh, I spent, and, uh, and what he, year, was, was this during 9 to 5 times, or was this in this the last 20 years? was just right after 9 to 5. Okay. And This um, is Dolly Parton's uh, husband, who really no one publicly has ever seen. He's shrouded in mystery. He's really good looking and tall and thin, and I went to their house, and I spent the night there, and sang with her backup, actually, at the Grand Old Opry. <laughs> wow. And, uh, <laughs> So we're sitting at the breakfast table, and I said, well, tell me how you two met. So he starts talking about how he was driving his truck, and he passed a 7-Eleven, and he said, there she was, drinking an RC Cola. And he, <laughs> and, 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 and 
The, and he got so worked up trying to describe what he saw that he fell over backwards in his chair. That's amazing. <laughs> That's awesome. He was driving. He was hysterical. He was driving a truck. And he pitched over backwards. No, he no, pitched no. over backwards While telling, he was telling the story. Me the story it takes her a while. But was he <laughs> driving? No, he was telling the story of driving. He's sitting at breakfast oh, telling oh, the yes. story of her house. Oh, I dropped out there at one point. <laughs> Back to the phones, caller, what's your name and from where are you calling? My name is Jennifer and I'm calling from Boston Spa, New York. Hey Jennifer, what's your question? My question is for both these ladies. What is the most annoying habit that either one of you has? Okay, so Lily, what is Jane's <laughs> most annoying habit? Well, you know, I can't say that she has any. Um, Jane, what oh. is Lily's most annoying well, habit? You know, I well, can't maybe say sometimes she when any. she bangs the door on her trailer. Okay. And then won't allow me in. Oh. And that sort of irks me. She's got like white carpeting. I do that. <laughs> Jane, what's Lily's uh, uh, biggest pet peeve? Oh, gosh. Oh, you weren't shy about saying it this afternoon or this morning. Well, she sometimes forgets her lines. Oh, okay. Um, Jane, this Yvonne B. This is the B. biggest lie that has ever been <laughs> put forth about me. Yvonne B. Facebook. Jane, um, Jane, can you ask Jane Fonda the three best life lessons she can pass on about men? She dated some good ones, and I was curious. What have you learned about men? What are three things you've learned about men? We have to men? have a lot of compassion. Okay. Okay because you guys have it really hard. Um, <laughs> we have to be very forgiving. And we can't take any shit from you. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Do you have any advice for men in dresses? Yes! <laughs> Do you have any advice for men in dresses? Yeah. Shanji wants to know. You answer that. Well, uh, I'd, I'd make sure that, uh, that your seams were straight. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you got the only thing straight over here, Mama. Yes. <laughs> uh, Kristen <laughs> K. texted line. Lily as the first out lesbian recipient of the Kennedy Center Honors. What did you think of the president skipping the ceremony this year? Oh, I thought good. I thought it was good. Right, right. No one wants to be foisted into that situation. Right. Um, let's go to Camilla from Texas. Hey, Camilla, what's your question? Hey, Andy, my question's for Jane. Okay. If you could remove one movie from IMDb, which movie would it be? In the Cool of the Day. Is that a movie you did? It was so bad, I don't even know if it was released. Really? Angela Lansbury and Peter Finch. Really? I love it. Okay, last question. Devron F., what was your favorite scene in 9 to 5? When we got stoned. We didn't really get stoned, though. No, but we were acting very well. And we did. We acted very well. Yes. <laughs> Do you have a favorite a scene in 9 to 5? What? Do you have a favorite scene in 9 to 5? Uh, I, like the, I like the stone scene, yeah. but President Reagan did not. He did not. He liked the movie except for that. He oh, said, really? Oh, he did said he say in his that? book and his memoirs that they could have left that part out. R nice. Um, I like Crescent You know something White. funny? Dolly, she'd never made a movie before, you yeah. know what I mean? And what we discovered on the first day of shooting, she'd met, she thought she was supposed to learn the whole script. Unbelievable. She, she knew Unbelievable. the whole script. That's yeah. incredible. And then there was the day that she showed up with her fingernails and sang us the song that oh, she just it was wow. so divine. playing wow. it like a, on a washboard. Unbelievable. Our hair stood on it. Okay, last question. What was the last movie of your, your own that you saw? What, what was your own last movie that you saw? Well, the one I just, I did with Bob Redford called Our Souls at Night. Yes. And I did, I did Grandma in 2015. Oh, yeah. oh that was so great. So you good. Were so great in that movie. I want to thank Jane Fonda and Lily Tom and Jason Parker for Thank you, Queens, for more Click Around Bravo TV. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.